Hello Pisces, welcome to the channel guys, it's uh, Rad and uh, oops, in this <laughs> the Empress card fell down so in this uh, old video we're going to check into your weekly reading which concerns the period of uh, July 18th up until July 24th, uh, 2022nd and if you are interested in a having personal reading with me you can always uh, go to my website which you're going to find in the description down below and there on the very front page you can see full list of my services and as well their pricing so with that said let's uh, do the cut and see what we got for you uh, the first card for you Pisces uh, that it seems that it stands as the world card followed up with the second here which uh, stands as the magician moving on next uh, we do have the four of pentacles and the final card uh, for you, Pisces, that, that's going to be a really good week for you. Uh, we do have the Queen of Pentacles. So these are uh, pretty much these four cards. Well, <laughs> the week ahead of you, Pisces, it seems... I don't want to say the word uneventful. I would say the word settling. So... It is a settling week and uh, I, I will start with the and this is in in kind of like in brackets the discouraging aspects of the week which is that magician really there into the second position and that speaks that no new applications or implications can be made into your uh, into your current enterprises and the, why that is you may uh, you may ask it is because your enterprise uh, or enterprises that is your under your undertakings are in a stage where they are either almost near completion or they are uh, on almost near completion of a cycle and so making last minute changes it's only gonna hurt the project itself more than it's gonna help it it's not like you can't do these changes you can't kind of like try to be creative you can but it's going to make things more complicated than it needs to be that is almost like shooting yourself into the foot just before the finish line kind of like falling down the ground nor be and, and having to crawl to finish the the line rather than jog through it so what we have into the week here that world the world that the world card and the four of pentacles it's, it's one of the best alignments i would like to see when it comes to finalizing start finalizing negotiations you know finalizing uh, a point made okay uh consolidating job work or uh winning uh a work kind of like getting a client and so on and so forth it's pretty much those two cards shows that you will be able to establish a solid and secured future about something in your life now that something is going to be different for every single one of you Pisces for some of you is going to be establishing a solid relationship for a life for others is going to be a solid stream of revenue for a, a life uh, uh, for others is going to be a solid interactions with a person that is going to help you for a life that that is the the, the key factor here okay for a, a life because as in an environment the world card really shows that the whole thing is going to wrap up into that environment meaning that is going to settle for is what it is and nothing will be able to change it from there on moving forward and it's going to sit into that state for the for, uh, to the end of time okay so the only thing that you gotta be careful of is what you are making and what you are saying because once you say it or once you make it you won't be able to take it back so be mindful when you say someone I don't like you or I do like you or I don't love you or I love you it doesn't matter if you are saying the truth or not it will stick and it will stick for the rest of time that what you do and what you say is going to establish the certainty 
of your future that that is going to be your domain which we can see with the queen of pentacles now this domain could be as pleasant as possibly can uh, it could be as well as irritating as possibly can it's it's just it will be your making that's uh, that's my point here so that is one side of the reading itself that we do have here but the question stands all right so i'm gonna come to a conclusion right i'm gonna finish something very important in my life whether i'm gonna finish being single and establish a lifetime long relationship or whether i'm finished being unemployed and i'm gonna strike a really nice job that is going to carry it carry me on for the rest of my life what happens next well the world card it's oftenly halfway interpret in uh in tarot readings because having the completion is only halfway through the world card the world card it is when you know you are sitting on uh, 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 well in english the expression is on the top of the world and what it is there on the top of the world aside from the peak you tried to climb right well the vista it is on the top of the world you survey you see every single direction therefore you can take on new things and, and that is simultaneously what the week asks you to do so once you consolidate and, and establish a certain and secure future of your job or of your love life or of your friendship you instantly have to start thinking of something new something different okay you established a, a certain future in your love life great you, you have no problem about your love life anymore maybe now it's time for you to think of a new hobby to practice maybe it's time for you to think of how you can excel into your career maybe it's time for you to think of to expand your social circle just, just it has to be something new and something different those both things and uh, having the magician into the second position you don't have to be a brainiac about it just do just go about with something you are comfortable with you have some experience you have some some skill with it as well you have some uh, past with it like the magician being there means that you don't have to start or, or rather like you should not start from a, a scratch the best thing that i can think of it is that it should be a an undertaking that you have left hanging back in the days because i don't know reasons because you had too much things on the on your plate which were more important etc uh, etc having the four of pentacles into the third position it also speaks that you uh pisces are going to how can i put it in well, well that that is a card when you take every precautionary measure in order to defend what you have established and and that is why no nothing and no one will be able to take away what you are going to make for yourself throughout that particular week unless you decide to abandon it and uh, finally here the summarize of all that it is that you don't even know what you're getting what i mean is that you thought that you get a diamond as a uh, as a culmination of your work and you are right it's a diamond unpolished one and when i say you don't know what you are getting it is that what you are getting with that queen of pentacles at the end it has way bigger potential than you have anticipated so if you had established a, a long life relationship that relationship is going to be better than you have expected a long life job better than you have expected a long life uh, friendship a better than you have expected so you're definitely going to get something uh, a bigger price for the investment you put it in and so with that said that is uh your tarot reading hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it guys and uh, we are going to see each other next time until then bye